what is up to smaller 13 here and today I'm bringing you my Q&A video now this video will serve as my update video for the month of May you know I do that every month <laughs> it's actually quite a late one it's actually already the 8th of May but yeah a quick note on the gameplay in the background it is it's not the greatest gameplay but it is a long gameplay and that's what I was that's all I really needed um just a quick note this will probably go into two parts uh, probably the first part will be my Q&A video and the second part will be my update sort of thing so let's just get straight into things all these questions come from the Q&A video I put out well the me asking for questions for this video um, about two weeks ago so uh, it's not a lot of questions but I have to say they are really good questions so here we'll just dive straight into things in order of which the questions were posted cool7141 asks what is the next game you want to or are going to upload to your channel in the future? Now, um, I have a few ideas for games that I'm going to be uploading to my channel. As you know, I'm not really a person that just likes to stick to Call of Duty. I do like Battlefield, I do like a lot of other games. So, um, I really don't know. Well, to give you a proper answer, because I really don't know, but a proper answer would be... Um, I've never posted a Modern Warfare 2 game on my channel so in the next live com session you'll get to see me playing Modern Warfare 2 for the first time so that'll be that'll be pretty cool but in terms of like future games um I don't know I'm, I suppose you can just look forward to me posting Halo 4 um Black Ops 2 obviously and uh maybe some few other games along the way we'll see what happens and maybe even Minecraft when I get my new PC but um thanks for that question cool 7141 and uh the Octane Effect asks would you rather work as a as an editor for Machinima or carry on your channel. Now, um, I'm assuming you mean just work, f just carry on working with necessary gaming. I'm just gonna just sort of change this question a bit because it's, it's kind of vague. Like, uh, and work as an editor for Machinima. I'm just gonna say, like, would I rather have a contract with Machinima so I could post videos there or carry on working with necessary gaming? And um, it's a tough one. It is a really tough one. But I would have to say I'd love to carry on working with uh, Necessary Gaming. Purely for the fact it's just like, because we've sort of built it up from sort of scratch, you know, as, as you know. Which is, uh, it's quite, it's, it's really, it's a really good just to see something grow. And uh, even though I'm not like the creator of it or anything, I have put some a lot of time in and uh, recruiting and developing things that happen with Necessary Gaming so I would have to just stick where I am and just grow my own channel along with Necessary Gaming. So yeah, great question, Octane. So um, Okram125 actually has two questions. Uh, his first question is, if you could have any superpower, what would it be? And uh, um, I'd probably say invisibility because there's nothing else like it like you can't like people say do you want to be able to fly like, uh, no we can do that already I'd, I'd rather be invisible um for reasons which you can uh, decipher for yourself <laughs> and um what was the first video game you ever played that's a good question uh, i don't actually know for sure oh well no i do know the first game, video game i ever played it was on the nintendo 64 it was James Bond Goldeneye, is that what it's called? Yeah, Goldeneye, that was a really great game. It actually wasn't mine, I didn't own a Nintendo 64, it was actually my cousin's that we used to play on split screen. So uh, yeah, I can remember that being really fun. So that was the first video game I've ever played. Thank you, Okram. Knight5225 asks, What moment in, do you wish in gaming you recorded? And that is a really good uh, question. And I would have to say on... Modern Warfare 2 right at the start there was these trash talkers just these like I'd have to say 13 year old kids full of trash talking which uh, would have been 13 at the time probably but anyway they were trash talking really bad and um, I was myself and uh, I pulled all out played the best game I've ever played and I won a game of domination basically, basically myself beat a full party and they were so raging that they had to rage quit and um, I so wish I had recorded that because that, that was pretty epic that would have made an amazing video and uh, he actually has another question, what would you change about any game you play and why? Uh, Modern Warfare 3 and everything, uh, because the game sucks. So there you go, I've answered that question. Mr Scudrud asks, where do you see yourself in five years? And I have to honestly say, I do not know. Probably in university, 
studying some, studying for some degree probably, that's where I see myself in five years still, and uh, studying away. But uh, yeah, thanks for that Scudrud. Absolutely Simba asks, how old are you? Simple question, I am, I am 16 years old, uh, I will be turning 17 in June, so yeah. James on games has uh, he actually has two questions, but his first question is: If you were stuck on an island with one game, what would it be, and what console PC would it be on? Uh, I'd have to say, if I could choose any future game, I'd probably say uh, Grand Theft Auto V because uh, just simply the the diversity in GTA, where you can just do anything you want for as long as you want. Basically, I can have endless fun in that. Presuming that the game's good. If it sucked, well, that would be some failure and a boring life. So, um, yeah, I'd be playing GTA when I'm not scavenging for f uh, firewood and other things <laughs> like that. But, yeah, great question, James. I know should be asked, why did you start YouTube? That is, um, I was actually thinking of do a vi doing a video uh, purely on this question alone. But um, in a short 30 seconds or so, I'd have to say, I basically started it as a sort of online diary, I'd have to say. I started it just as a way to sort of express myself, but as sort of people, I don't know, decided that they like me and they think I'm actually doing a, a pretty decent job, I decided to, to carry on with it. So, yeah, here we are today. Thanks, Irish Rugby. That is a great question. And uh, James on Games with his second question. If you could live in a uh, game world of your choice, what would it be? And again, it would have to be... Uh, the next Grand Theft Auto presume and that it's a good game just just for the sake of like, it's, <laughs> it's probably as close as you're going to get to real life anyway but yeah thanks James again and that uh, final question Agent Sparky78 how many subs do you hope to have by the end of the year and you know for me there's no specific question that if there was a minimum I'd love to have 1k by the end of the year that would be amazing but um, I'd really have to answer as much as possible. <laughs> that is really as much as I could say, as many as like, possible. Because, you know, I mean, I can just have to hope that people carry on liking what I'm putting out there. So, uh, yeah, that's basically all I can really say for that. Thanks, Agent Sparky78. And thank you, all of you guys who asked all of the wonderful questions. Thank you for 400 subscribers, guys. And that is why I'm putting this QA video out there. I can't thank you enough for supporting my content. For liking the videos, for commenting on the videos, so yeah, I just, I swear to God, I just can't thank you enough for, for the support you gave me, and uh, roll on another 400. I'll be, <laughs> I'll probably bring out another Q&A video when I, when I hit 800 subscribers. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna move this on to a part two, I guess. So uh, yeah, the part two is basically just gonna be. Um, Sort of my, my monthly updates that I always do. It's still going to be the same gameplay in the background. So um, I'll see you there in about four or five hours or so when I upload the next part. Okay.